So this is a 95% efficient furnace. Uh, it's a closed combustion unit, and what that means is these two pipes that are coming out the top of it, rather than just having a B vent, a normal conventional furnace used to just draw air from the rest of the house to burn, and then it would take that combusted air and the products of combustion or the exhaust that we need to get rid of would vent out through the roof. Fairly loose system. If that happened to backdraft, you had the possibility of getting carbon monoxide inside your home. So there was a lot of rules associated with that. You had to have a louver door to make sure you had plenty of uh, combustion air going to that. This is a far better system that, uh, that's been developed now. One of these white pipes brings in nice uh, fresh air to burn from the outside. The other one delivers that exhaust air to the outside. This door right here can be a solid door now. We don't have to worry about that. We're gonna install a high quality air filter on the inside. It takes up the whole space of this cabinet. So rather than the little one that you may have seen before, this is gonna be a thick media filter that's really gonna catch all the dust and particulates that you don't wanna have circulating around inside your home. And at some point, we also need to bring in some nice fresh air for you and your family to breathe. If you're just popping open a window, that's unregulated air. You've got the possibility for pollens and particulates to come into the home that you don't necessarily want to breathe. On the other hand, we want to make sure that we're constantly circulating in the air in your home so it stays nice and healthy. That's what this pipe right up here is going to do. That's a fresh air intake damper. It's got a timer on it that we're going to have uh, interfaced with your thermostat uh, on a regular basis. That's going to call for air. This uh, electronic damper inside this fresh air uh, duct right here will open up. It'll draw nice fresh air from the inside or from the outside in. And your furnace, it'll run it through the uh, media filter that we've installed right here. And your furnace will distribute that fresh air throughout the home on a regular basis. All right, so we've installed a weather resistant barrier on the outside of your home to keep the weather on the outside. Uh, we talked a little bit about the ability for air to drive uh, moisture into or out of the home. Uh, that's also going to have an impact on the draftiness and the comfort of your home and the energy efficiency of your home. So it's important to us that we seal the home up completely. We get a complete separation of the exterior of the home from the interior of the home. Some of the air sealing details that uh, you may not have seen in the past are going to be, we're going to have uh, foamed or caulked in between big gaps in the studs on the inside to the exterior wall uh, that you see right there. Around the pipes in the floor and the pipes in the top plate, we're gonna have a foam insulation around that and or caulking to, to gap any holes that you might see there. And up at the top of the top plate, there's a foam gasket here that's gonna compress against the uh, drywall as it attaches to it. And it's just gonna keep any of that air uh, from the attic space or uh, that may have dropped into the walls at any point from getting into the airspace of the home. So we've got control of the air that's moving into this home, the fresh air that's moving into this home and the air that we're moving out.